another exciting episode of the Boring. My fellow campers, this is your Wicked Wednesday host, Callan Hill. Sorry, still a little bit sick. If you are enjoying this, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe below. As always, grab your favorite snacks, grab your favorite snacks, grab your favorite snacks, sit back, relax, close the blinds, turn out the lights, and let's get spooky. Picking up right where we left off with Nick, we were about to talk to Abby. Normally I record these ahead of time, but due to being sick and some losses, I've been able to. Hey, so this may not be like the best time per se, but like. What? Yes, yeah, so like I was just. You know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and the start of camp and well, like now that summer's over and you know, is that like the last time we're gonna see each other, you know? Oh, sorry, Nick, what what are you saying? We're gonna go and see Hey, you. I'm kinda pouring my heart out here. Nick, I'm, I'm sorry. Can we talk about this later? I'm, I'm really freaked out. It's just not a good time. Maybe I was misreading the situation back there, but... I kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? Duh, are you dumb? Hey. Sorry. I just mean, of course I wanted it to happen. I just didn't know if you did too. Can't tell if that or food's seems cool. like such a long time ago now. You did want it to happen though. Uh, um, I, you can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. <laughs> You're just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. What's going on out there, Caitlin? We have died. We have died. It's okay, I got this. Oh my god. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, it used to be more of a actual radio station, actually. Um, uh, it, you know, I mean, it is still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. It's weird, actually, that there used to be kids with their radio and their portable CD player and everything, and, you know, nowadays, everything we need is on the phone, but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day at camp so that we're not distracted by technology. Technology, it giveth and it taketh. So is is that something like that you want to go into? Camp radio? No, like uh, DJing or music. 
something. Oh, um, yeah, I mean, I like music, but I think I want to major in um, quantum physics. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you don't really seem like a science guy. Oh, yeah, I mean, you know, not, not here. Um... I'm, I'm sorry. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at camp. I do that at home, and then here... I, um... You're a wise, wise, cracking smartass? <laughs> uh, that's a little harsh, but... Uh... No? Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation, and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé Dylan. Uh... And do, do you enjoy the blasé, Dylan? <laughs> Not yet. Like, you know, whatever, man. It's pretty cool. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dylan Dylan. I'm Ryan Ryan. Well, actually, I'm let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. <laughs> yeah, I like him. He's That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Camp activity scoreboard shooting stars Tate one thirty five, JP twenty one, Chesney eighteen. Sharpe, A15, Diesel 12, Ryan Hine, Brooklyn 7, J6, Idris 5, Kristen 4. Something back could really take your hands off. What is this doing at a kid's summer camp? I don't know, man. That's... It wasn't here over the summer. I mean, if it was, then... We would have noticed that, right? Well, whatever it was trying to catch, you can't now. Close attention and act before the demons unleash. Each of us has one. Even those who are pure of heart can say their prayers by night.
take off the air and show us what all those bunch of pictures do. That's why Nurse Kelly went home early. Chase can guide you to safety, but that all depends on your actions, not his. Okay. Well, not off, not off to a bad start. We've got two cards so far. All good? All good? Oh, this place is kind of a dump, huh? Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay. 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 Let me get this set up. All right. Anything over here we can use? The power tools? No. Um, that's... Mr. H wanted more storage, so it's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever, so I think the range is about a mile. How do you even know all this stuff? Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to get a handle on. Well, if you like, I could show you the ropes. Like a class? Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Sign me up, teach. Anyways, this thing's going to need a bit of a power up, um, but that's where this comes in. Dust magnet. It's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. So, we can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two-way radio, so, um, you know, we can talk, 
Uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back, which is unlikely, but... Well, it, I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Yeah. So, what should I say? Uh, just, like, make it sound urgent. Okay. Hello, how's it going out there? This is, uh, uh, we need help. This is, uh, we are counselors at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, and there's been a horrible accident attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are everywhere, and there's these hunters too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good, and a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help, so please, I mean, there's vicious bears, and uh, we don't know what to do, so please uh, come help us, SOS, uh, this is uh, an emergency, S save our ship, come on down, please help us. Yeah, I do good, was that? Swarm of bears? Yeah. Herd of bears? Yeah, I've heard of bears, but... Oh my god. All right, I, I guess I should just like switch this over to the receiver and see if we get anything yeah, back. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie stuff. Okay, yeah, sure. Wait, did he did he say lodge? I don't know. Hold on. Two males in the radio shack near the cabins. Another couple unaccounted for. Copy that. Out. Out. We can't be sure they were talking about us. Uh, I don't know. I, it really, really sounded like they were. But that's... That's not possible, right? Oh, shit. They know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Hey, hey, shit. Let's, let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's, let's go find Caitlin and everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. I wasn't sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? I have no idea. Uh, Ryan? Is it a bear? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick, they're coming up the path. Oh, shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Um, what about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can um, tell them to hide or something. Yeah. Uh, oh, fuck, no. Oh, shit. Uh, the... uh, hold the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get into, uh, get into a cabin now. Go! Go! Oh, fuck, dude. 
they're gone. And with that, my fellow campers, is where we're going to end this episode for Wicked Wednesday. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. As always, I've been your host, Callan Hale. And please make sure to hydrate, medicate if you have to, be kind to yourselves, and be kind to each other. And remember, you're not alone. If you feel like you need to talk to somebody, there are people who you can reach out to. Thank you everybody for hanging out with me during this episode, and I will see you on the next episode for Terrifying Thursday tomorrow. Bye, fellow campers.